Hey people, how y'all doing? Right quick, I just wanted to say thank you so much, Earl of Suave, aka Jimmy, aka the man. I got the bag, man. I got the bag. So cool of you, Earl. Jimmy, I hope I do actually meet you. Um, you're a dynamic person. There's something about your rock and roll spirit that shines through very, very clear to me and very, very truly to me. You seem like a genuinely decent, truly decent man. And um, the way that you went about this contest, the things that you gave to people, including me, through my music, uh, you know, these words I'm reaching for are inadequate to express the love, respect, appreciate, and appreciation that I feel coming from you, and I want to give back. Um, this is a dynamite bag with the zip on the top, man. This is, I'm be using this, be using this baby. You know, among other things, um, I'll use it when I shop at Aldi's, which is a uh, local uh, discount place where you, they encourage you to bring your own bag. Um, just thanks so much, man. Um, real quick, the only other thing I'll say is I just got in the mail. Number three, Boris. The heavy rock singles that they put out, the others are on their way, number two and number one. Really having a lot of fun getting into Boris because there's something about Boris that I can't quite put my finger on that intrigues me and makes me listen deeper. Even though on the surface it just sounds like heavy rock, there's something else going on here. When they played here in Omaha about longer than I think realized. I think it was 2008. Seems like it was more recent. I waited a long time to try to meet them afterwards and they never came out. You know, I waited a long time. Never came out of the dressing room. Really wanted to meet them. So anyway, that was the other nice thing that happened today. But back to the most important thing I want to share. Jimmy Earl of Swab, you are a true, true gentleman. Thank you so much for everything being a part of the community, for being my long distance friend. Um, I was, I drove through New Jersey for the first time in my life last year on tour. Um, seems like we for a minute had a New Jersey gig and then it got canceled, but I had to go to Philly and I'm pretty sure we drove through New Jersey. I don't, I saw New Jersey, I, I do know that. So someday I do sincerely hope that we can shake hands, my brother. Thank you again.